From Pandesal, Taho, and Silog Meals, we will do a deep dive into what makes a good Filipino breakfast. So, let's find eat. So, after watching Joshua Weisman's American vs. Filipino Breakfast, it got us wondering, what are the best Filipino breakfasts out there? There's Pandesal and Kape, Silog Meals, Taho, Lugaw, sir. Mm, there's a lot. So, we asked the people what their favorite breakfast is. Pansit, sopas, pancake. Maybe oatmeal. Okay. Yeah. Pritong talong, kamatis na may sibuyas. Pansit, canton, tsaka pandesal. Para, parang full course meal siya. Pero nakakabusog. Oh my God! Breakfast food. Mm, almost Filipino, it's toyo and then egg. Then fried rice. Itlog. Itlog. <laughs> itlog. Hotdog. Bam silog. Yung itlog mismo, side and side up. Ah! Hindi luto yung pula. Tatapings mo dun sa may ibabaw ng mainit. Init na sinangag. Then saka mo kakati ng kutsara, makikita mo yung kala mo laba. Napakasarap niyan. Tapos imimekos-mekos mo siya doon sa sinangag. Yan ng bangos na mataba. At isasaw-saw mo sa sukang pinakura. Sobrang sarap niya mga brand. Madalas, uh, itlog, ano? Itlog. Corn beef. Hotlog. <laughs> Hotlog may itlog, tsaka ano, sinangag. Sinangag. Yeah, silog. Pero madalas kong kainin yung silog pag midnight snacks. Mm, hotdog, egg. Mm. <laughs> uh, itlog na may corn beef. Mga danggit, tuyo. Egg, egg yan. Laging may egg pag breakfast. Sausage with egg, plain or fried rice. Hot dog. Hot dog? <laughs> egg. Simple lang. Tuyo na talong. Tuyo and sinangag. There's something good about the saltiness and the umami flavor from the fish. And if you dip it in vinegar, di ba, mas masarap. Napapadami yung kanin. Sometimes, you could throw in an egg. Fried rice, tapos may scrambled egg. Po, silog. Mm -hmm. Fried with egg. Huh? Uh, ano ba to? Fried rice. Egg. Corned beef. Sa akin, corned beef. Silog. Breakfast, sinangag. At silog, o silog. Daing po. Tsaka itlog, silog. Top silog. Tuyo po. Fried rice. Danggit sa hotdog lang sa itlog. Okay na. Um, sa breakfast, gusto ko ano, longganisa. Long silog, na dalawa yung sunny side up, tapos itlog na pula, tsaka kamatis. <laughs> Mga silogs. Tuyo, itlog, sinangag. Kape, pandesal, tusino, silong at ito. Dahil yun na yun, nakasanayan ko sumula bata pa. Wow, si Log has the most answers. Hmm, more on that later. My go-to breakfast is coffee and bread. And sometimes I dip the bread to the coffee like a typical Filipino breakfast. You know, pandesal. So very delicious. <laughs> yeah, boy. Bread with egg, pandesal po. Tinapay lang. Slice bread. Bread and milk po. Nag-bread ako, saka kopi. Pandisal lang. Okay na ako. Doon masaya na ako doon sa pandisal. <laughs> May kape, oo. Oh, oh. The best talaga yung pandisal at saka kopi. Para sa akin, pang lalaking breakfast lang. Coffee, itlog, pandisal, all good in the hood. It's tall and oh my god, Okay, no way, mom. at kape or bread. These two go really well together with each other, and each country in the world has a similar pairing. But as a Filipino, nothing beats dipping your hot pandesal into a nice cup of hot coffee in the morning. It's nice, light, and it's a quick breakfast, usually taken by the people who are on the go and who don't have time to cook in the morning. Aros caldo. Lugao. Yun yung parang madalas namin bine-breakfast dito sa office. Goto. Siyempre, goto. May sabaw, mainit. So, it satisfies uh, my tummy every morning, especially with the chongkawali. Ariscaldo. Kasi mainit. Goto po. May lit ipahok sa chan. Ariscaldo. Tapos nakakadagdag siya ng energy kasi carbs mo. And also, mura lang siya. Mm, Ariscaldo. Kasi may manok. <laughs> Aros kaldo po. Yan, isa sa mga favorite ko rin kong food kit. Hmm, lugaw, goto, or aros kaldo. Actually, we have a full episode about that. Suggest you check it out over here. Also, another consideration in this category, champurado. Sa akin, kakaiba talaga yung favorite ko. Champuradong may egg. Huh? May egg? 
Mm-hmm. Kaya alam na nung tindera sa amin pag ano, bumili ako, ito yung binibili ko, champurado kong may itlog. Parang kakaiba yung lasa niya kasi pag sa champurado siya nilagay. <laughs> Sampurado guys, kaya red egg. Ipakita bo, ang sabi nga naman ka pong... Oh, hell no! But champurado with hard-boiled egg? What the f***? Champurado, yeah. <laughs> with super madaming milk. <laughs> May powder na, tapos meron pang evaporada. Okay, this is the normal way to eat champurado. Oh. Taho, kasi... When we go to office, tapos hindi ka nakakain sa house, readily siyang nakikita sa pagpasok ng office, meron niya naglalako ng taho. Taho, mas mabilis siyang mabili at saka mas mabilis siyang bitbitin. Especially kung nagmamadali ka sa umaga, tapos kailangan mo ng quick breakfast talaga. At since na yung taho naman is soy at saka sweet din, so may sa sweet, kaya taho yung pinipili ko. If you live in a place where there is still a taho vendor walking around your streets, make sure you support them guys because they're, they're a bit of a dying breed, I know. It's another quick and easy breakfast. Uh, just drink it and go. Please support them. Breakfast, egg, scrambled egg. Itlog. Egg. Ano, pang ano na rin siya, diet, ganun. Eggs only? Wow, diet. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, but on the flip side, there are a lot of people who say rice is life. With basa with rice, okay na oh basa with rice. Um, rice, <laughs> I love rice. Garlic rice, fried rice, any rice. All right, but what is breakfast? It is common knowledge that breakfast is the most important meal of the day. It's usually consumed in the morning, but the literal meaning of breakfast is breaking the fast of the previous day. So nowadays, intermittent fasting is a common practice for people who want to lose weight, right? So now breakfast is usually eaten in the morning, has burnt a little, and your fast can be broken at any time of the day. And with that, what makes a good breakfast? Most nutritionists would say to have at least three of these five food groups. Dairy, lean proteins, carbohydrates, fruits, and vegetables. Most silog meals only have two, proteins and carbohydrates. But for us Filipinos, it's usually good enough to fill you until lunch. Now let's go a little bit deeper and talk about all the types of silog. They had the most answers. So basically, you can silog any protein. And if you guys didn't know, the name silog is a portmanteau. And in case you didn't know what a portmanteau means, it's usually two words that blend the sound of two meanings of the two words. Hence, C means sinangag or fried rice and log is for itlog, which means eggs. Furthermore, you can portmanteau any protein with silog. Tapa, tap silog, tosino, tosilog, longganisa, long silog, bangus, bang silog, spam, spam silog, corn beef, corn silog, hot dogs, hot silog, Hungarian sausage, hang silog, <laughs> Hungarian silog maybe, <laughs> fried chicken, chick silog, pork chops, pork silog, pusit. <laughs> and so on and so forth. So basically, anything can be silog as long as you have a fried egg and garlic fried rice. So maybe like silog, subscribe silog. Uh. It's time to taste. Sticky man type. These are from Kakaos. Kakaos. <laughs> you gave us a spork and a fork. <laughs> That's the weirdest thing. But anyway, we have an array of different silog meals over here. This is the number one things. This is the hot silog, ever famous top silog. This is the pork silog, which is a pork chop. This is chicken tocino. That's why it's like this color. Of course, corned beef silog corned beef silo over here. It's not rocket science over here. And this is just the way we do things here in the Philippines. Hot dog, eggs, and garlic fried rice. Oh my gosh. How am I going to do this? It works, okay. So hot dog and their garlic fried rice and egg. Oh, it's really good. Mm, you know what? It really hits the spot. This one's not the tapa. Mm, it's also very good. 
The tapa has a, a slight sweetness to it and it pairs so well with the garlic rice and the eggs. Let's get some of the corned beef. You know what? I'll just use the other. <laughs> the sport is hard now. <laughs> what do you think this corned beef is? I think it's Argentina. 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 Definitely Argentina. But they put, they added some on, um, onions there, giving it a nice sweetness. Onion, 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 onion. This one is the chicken tocino this time. Chicken, oh, chicken tocino. You see, the coloration is different from the regular tocino, right? Because it's chicken, not pork. Egg, chicken tocino. Mm. So, the chicken tocino is actually really good. It's not too sweet, it's nice balanced flavor. I like it. Hmm. Oh, this one is going to be tough. I don't know if these two can do the job. Oh, pretty good. They already pre-cut some of the things, so pork chop. Hmm. Just needs a little ketchup or maybe mang tomas, but I am not mad at that at all. It's really good. Men just si silog meals just hit different. I think I'm not giving them vibes because they're not the best silog meals that I've ever, ever tasted. But silog meals as a whole, they're all five out of five. For cows, maybe they'd average a 4.2 overall. Very good. Mm, it's cold. <laughs> of course. You know what? Very good. Any silog. It's good, but it's cool. <laughs> but I like their chicken cuisine. 3.5. 4. Finally, a normal rating. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Not too good. New year, new joy. <laughs> it's alright. It's alright. It's a 3. 3.5. Cool. I'm going to get a big hand. 3.5? What? The, that's a normal rating. Why well, you know guys, silog means are really a staple here in the Philippines and it's a tough competition. A, a lot, a lot of good silog places out there so it's a really tough competition between them. Okay, okay, no, may bala ka dyan. Alright guys, so with that said, we hope you guys enjoyed the video and learned something new today. You know what? YouTube recommends this video, so maybe you should go and watch it. Alright, see you guys. Bye-bye.